Hi guys, in this video we're going to look at the factor tree. Now the factor tree is an application of prime factors and prime numbers. So what it does, it's basically a breakdown of a number into its prime factors. And there are, we can use two key terms here. And these key terms are prime factor decomposition And the other one is prime factorization. So what a factor tree actually looks like is, so if we have an example here, if the question was find the prime factors of 200, yeah? So we write 200 at the top. The first thing we do is we look at what we can multiply together to get 200. So the sim one of the easiest ways is to do 2 times 100, which gives us 200. Now we see that 2 is a prime number, so we circle it. We can't cut this down any further, so we look at the 100. Now 100 can be split into 2 times 50. We see that again... There's a 2 here and here's a prime number. So we can't cut that down anymore. We look at the 50. It can go into, it can be 2 and 25. Again, there's a 2 here. We can't cut this down any further either. So we look at the 25. And we can see here that 25 can split into 5 and 5. Because 5 times 5 is 25. Now, 5 and 5 are both prime numbers. So we circle them and we stop. That means that we can write 200 as, so here we have 1, 2, 3, 2, twos. So we write it as 2 cubed, yeah? And then we can multiply it by 5 squared. So again, let's start from the top. So 200 can be written as 2 times 100. 2 is a prime number, so we circle it and we look at the 100. 100 can be 2 times 50. And again, 2 is prime, so we circle it and we get look at the 50. 50 can be written as 2 times 25. Again, there's a 2, so we circle it because it's a prime number and we look at the 25. 25 can be written as 5 times 5. Now 5, both 5s here are prime numbers, which means we circle them and we stop because both of them are prime. And then we can rewrite 200 as 2 cubed times 5 squared. So that is an example of how we use prime numbers in a question. And a typical question will just ask, um, what is the... What can 200 be broken down into? So what are the prime factors or of 200? So we need to just rewrite it. We can use a factor tree. What are the factors of 200? How can we rewrite that? This can also be written as, if we come over here, we can also write, if we do an arrow right here, also be written as, so if we have 200 equals 2 cubed times 5 squared, we can also have it as 2 times 2 times 2 times 5 times 5 to show you in a clearer way if you are finding this difficult to understand that this there's three twos here which are also here and there's two fives here which are also here so in summary we have looked at an example of a factor tree there are two terms here which we can use to describe this as prime factor decomposition or prime factorization and we can rewrite this whole factor tree down into one sentence here. And if this is a little bit confusing, we look over here and we can, we can also write it as this. But this top one is just a simplification. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching.